As a registered veterinary technician, it is imperative to have the ability to safely and effectively restrain animals for routine procedures performed in the veterinary hospital. Examples where proper restraint is necessary include physical examination, venipuncture, IV catheter placement, administration of medication, as well as euthanasia, to name a few. It's important to identify when patients are struggling during restraint. It's also important to understand why they are struggling. Some of the reasons they may struggle are fear, lack of familiarity or confusion, discomfort, lack of leadership from the restrainer, or disobedience. All of these reasons could be a reason to have to place a muzzle on a patient. Another reason could also be patient aggression. If you need to place a muzzle on your patient, the first thing that you need to do is choose the most appropriate muzzle for them. Do you need a cage muzzle? Do you need a nylon muzzle? And is it the appropriate size for them? Notice how the technician is trying to approach the patient from either the side or from behind, rather than approaching from the front. They then quickly ensnare the top and bottom jaws in the muzzle. They then make sure the muzzle is properly secured behind the ears and pull the muzzle tight. To remove the muzzle, the technician will undo the clip and then remove the muzzle in a fashion that it is removed quickly and their hands are away from the patient's mouth and they can back away quickly to prevent them from being harmed.